Hello, everybody. So I am in the Garmin beta now. I've been waiting for it to come out just to see the differences. So in today's video, we're just going to show you the differences of what it was before versus what it is now. Not a huge difference, but it is some quality of life improvements. So as we go through here, when you first get up the beta, the thing will actually pop up, but I'm going to show you if it you missed it. You click on the more on the bottom right there, and then you click beta, which is the top one, and then join beta. So as soon as you flip that switch over, it's going to say, thanks, you're in for joining the beta. You know, thanks for helping us improve our Garmin Connect service. So from here, I'm actually just going to go back to the home tab. And then as soon as you go to the home tab, it says, okay, now we need to make some settings so we can make sure that your home tab is customized to your goals and what basically tiles show up there. So when you click through, it's gonna ask you what your goals are. These are the ones that are gonna be the most important to you. So it says select up to four on here. So you, I believe you could probably select two if you really wanted to or three. I just clicked the four just because, and then the next screen that you're presented with is preferences. So, from my understanding, this is just a weighting of where they are going to sit on the home page. So just click into there and say, hey, this one's the most important. This one is not that important. For me, stress is quite important. Sleep is important. And um, a couple other things. But I just went through here and cl clicked on here. So you can see I pushed steps as number two because it's not like super important to me. I know it is to some people, but it is not that important. I don't think that these make a huge difference of where they're at and what you put on there but just put the ones that you want to see in the front number five and the other ones was like number one so as soon as you click there it says yep got it so now your front home page is going to look different so you can see here i just clicked on the first tile there which is the top one and this is where i believe that the based on your goals are the ones that are on top here so i have my sleep I have my body battery, excuse me. And I also have my steps. I'm not sure why my steps were there because remember I rated it as number two and those don't really make a huge difference to me. But you can customize the screen if you'd like. The next one at the bottom is at a glance. These are, I believe, the tiles that you customize based on the preference from one to five. So if you click there and you click edit, you can see, oh, this is what I have and this is what I want to move around. So in the top section there where you have the bigger tiles, you could move them around and put eight up there. So you can see on the screen, I'm just going through and I'm clicking in the tile that I want to add. This is going to be very customizable to what you want. For me, I like last activity on there. So I didn't see it on there. So I clicked the last activity that I want to show up here. And then I just dragged it up to the top in the sections that I want. So when I go back to my home now, you'll see last activities there, hydration, I don't really use that very much. And then challenges at the bottom, I just hid because I don't really use the challenges very much. But at a glance, it's kind of nice that you can see the tiles there. They're a little bit bigger, but they're actually not any different than before if you did the expanded version which just kind of showed you the tiles in a different format. So with that, these are the major changes at this point for the beta. Just want to show you real quick in a video. Hopefully you thought that it was uh, informational and helpful to you. So if you're not in the beta, I'm sure you'll get in very soon. I've been a Garmin user for a long time. And while this is not a huge change for me, uh, it is nice that I could see it more information in one little section. With that, thanks for joining me today. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. Give my video a like if you've made it this far. I'm going to be doing some additional content in the future. Thanks again. Have a great day.